Here's an interesting clinical question for you. Is non-valvular atrial fibrillation somehow linked with peripheral vascular disease? I bet you don't know the answer, but now in Jack, researchers have looked at this, and the answer appears to be yes. What they simply did was take a number of people with non-valvular atrial fibrillation and do ankle brachial indices on all of them. It turns out that when you do this, the AB index of less than 0.9 occurs in about one in five patients, 21% of patients with non-valvular atrial fibrillation. I'm not sure what this link actually is or what causes this, but the important clinical take-home message here is that if you have a patient with non-valvular AF, think of doing an AB index. You might find peripheral vascular disease that you can treat early and may, in fact, be able to keep that disease from becoming a major problem for your patients with AF. For Cardiosource, I'm Peter Block. 